All right, you guys, today I'm working at Atlanta Lakes location. I'm grabbing all my stuff from my station. I'm going to show you why. By the way, we got one spot here at this location that just opened up. If you want a job at Headlines, hit us up. So I just got these lights. It comes with a, a two-pack, and they're like RGB lighting. You can put any color. They're nice and bright. If you guys want some of these, comes with two for like $350 or something like that. Link in the description. All right, y'all, new series, new series. So I got a whole bunch of crap in here for a couple reasons. Number one, I've noticed that a lot of you guys know I have a mentorship program that we've been doing for the past year. We've seen a lot of success. A lot of barbers have seen a lot of success. You know, there's some people that they don't understand. They don't see the vision. And most of the time it's very young barbers as far as age, right? They just don't understand. There's no shortcut, okay? The only shortcut that there is, is leveraging someone or leveraging a platform that's taking the time to figure things out. This is why franchises, this is why systems work. You can't just take Take pieces of what you want and think it's going to work for you. You have to use the whole stack of innovation. Here at Headlines, we've been building this brand, this company for 12, 10 years, I believe, about a decade, guys. So we know what the hell we're doing. We've taken some time off of out of our focus because of Tomb 45, because of Pia County, all the other things that we're building that are necessary innovation stacks to the things that we're doing with Headlines, to the things that we're doing as a whole. If you're not part of Headlines, the mentorship is a way of giving you the pieces, the innovation stack so that you can duplicate it but we're at a, at a place now where we are having to build a barbershop from scratch and i'm going to document the whole journey now we opened up a barbershop about eight miles away from our orlando lakes location where i'm constantly where you see me constantly cutting hair you guys see me in the barbershop cutting hair you know with my tutorials and that's the bexy location where you guys saw turbo mo if you haven't checked out that video go check out the video i dropped that video a week ago or something like that and in between those two locations we had an old barbershop where most of our barbers, we moved to Bexley. Now, this location is about three miles away from our Bexley location, about three and a half, four miles away from Orlando Lakes location. And so I want to make this a proof of concept that we can open a barbershop just like Publix opens locations, just like Wawa opens locations, just like Starbucks opens locations, just like McDonald's opens locations, very close to one another. <laughs> we understand our area, our demographics. We understand business. We understand market. Marketing, and I'm going to document this six month journey of us building this location back up. Now, this location's in an interesting spot. Very busy road here. Right now, it's not that busy because it's New Year's Day, so everybody's home chilling. And it's more so in a professional plaza, professional center, an office center. The reason why we built this barbershop here about four years ago, five years ago, was because there was no other plazas in this area, and we wanted to be the first barbershop brand in the area, carving our name, our brand into the community. We always said we were going to open our actual plaza. And that was our Bexley location, but that's three miles away. So knowing what we know today, we know we can open another location that close and it'll be successful. So we're going to actually keep this location and we're going to rebuild it. Now, the reviews in this location aren't that great. We're going to improve that. It needs a little bit of TLC. You guys can see we are at our new location, Bexley. Give us a call if you have any questions. Okay. But we're going to start from scratch. Nate is on his way. I'm going to introduce you guys to Nate. I'm going to work at this location, market the hell out of it and do my tutorials here. We're going to document in the vlogs the growth of this location. Our challenge is, this is the challenge, we're gonna build this thing back up, busy as hell, completely full, every station full of barbers in six months or less. That's the goal, six months or less. Do you guys think we can do it? So I'm gonna open up the shop, I'm gonna show you guys around, but that's the challenge. Can we, with zero barbers, go from zero barbers to a full barber shop with a bunch of barbers making six figures in less than six months? Let me know if you, what you guys think about this series. Bro, why is it so dark in here? Super, super dark in here. I think because it used to have lights and stuff, but, but we got to work on that. The shop has seen better days, that's for sure. But we're going to give it some TLC. I'm excited for it. Here go Big Head Nate. This the man that's going to help build this thing up. He's going to run the show. I told him about our six months challenge. Oh yeah, looking forward to it, man. This is gonna be dope, man. We're gonna prove exactly what we've been doing, but we never documented it. So facts. The fact that we're gonna document this one so that we can duplicate is gonna be fun. Is that a beat? Watch out, that's a damn beat. Hey, get him out of here. Get out of here. Get the hell out of here. But yeah, I'm excited to show you guys this. Um, I got a whole bunch of stuff that I gotta bring inside the shop. And uh, listen, part of the system is the marketing machine. Not just marketing to clients, marketing to barbers. This is actually the reason why I started a YouTube channel, was to have more reach to barbers so that they can become part of our team. 
seen. Obviously, it became much bigger than that, and uh, 245 was born because of it. The mentorship was born because of it, but that doesn't mean that it's, it's an advantage. This was something that we had to build, and this is what I mean. It takes time to build that type of reach to barbers. We're played in barber schools all over the country. We are last like five to eight hires were people who moved from out of state and started from scratch. Just like any other profession, any other job and in industry, people will relocate for a better opportunity. There's people who relocate for you know, a $5 raise. It's insane. Why can't that happen in barbering? And it happens here at Headlines. And this is what I mean by leveraging somebody's platform. This is what I mean when I said Jordan, for example, his first year out of barber school made well over six figures. Second month out of barber school, he made $10,000. It's because he leveraged the right platform, the right team, but he also put in work. And we have a system to follow. We have a method that works, guys. This is just the fruit of the labor of a long time of building something, guys. And so this is why I believe in six months or less, we're going to have a super successful location here. And it's going to be like the Starbucks right, right here. Starbucks three miles away. There's a Starbucks three miles away that way. And there's going to be a headlines near every Starbucks. Yo, guys, real quick. Another point I want to make. You got your YouTube channel already? Yes. Nate Motivates. Nate Motivates. I will tag him in the description. Follow him because he's going to be documenting it. Like he's going to be here running the show. Like he's building this because in six months, the goal is for him to be able to open his own location to start that process. So we got six months to build this up and then we'll start doing the process to open his shop so that a year from now, he's got his location. A year or less from now. Stay tuned. Stay tuned. I'm also going to be vlogging this whole process, man. So this is going to be fun, man. Hey, just for full context, every year, Josh O.P., if you don't know Josh O.P., amazing artist, go follow him on Instagram, you'll see some amazing work, has an amazing academy as well. But that's my boy, that's my brother, I met him in Russia years ago. It was like his first year of barbering, and he, he grew to be an amazing leader in our industry. But every year, he comes to the States from England, from the UK, and uh, he does a tour, he educates, and he usually stays at my house. So he'll go to Arizona, and usually Tampa is kind of home base, and he's planning on moving to Tampa. So anyways, this time he came down, we took him to a Bucks game and then we took him to a lightning game he did a I think it was like a five-day course hands-on course here and so this is just me kind of documenting those days we went to the lightning game that was an amazing experience my first time his first time at a lightning game at a hockey game that's what the, all this content's about so we are here at the Josh OP class he's doing a, a five-day course hands-on course at the studio my wife's studio so me and S craft we're pulling up to say what's up to all the guys here with one of the goats of the industry what's up bro you good how you feeling from last Last night. Feeling wonderful. <laughs> Alright, that's my wife's studio. Let's see what they up to. Hi, yeah. welcome to our class. Man, it's, <laughs> like this. it's packed in here. Hey, exposed, hey. exposed. What up, what up, what up? Packed class. We got Ali here. Is Bossy up? No. What up, what up, what up? What up? <laughs> A new wall saver. I like the ergonomics here. They don't. That's because nice. I'm being super gentle though. I like the like these, this. that can be heavier handed and it knocks at you. Close right through with your hand. I even think you can feel it with your hand. That looks amazing. All right, so we went to the Buzz game. Took Josh to go see the Buzz game. Y'all already know Josh. Out to Josh. So this is our first time going to a Lightning game. We'll see if it ends up to the hype. Bucks game that we went to was crazy. Though. I want to see some fighting. Yeah. Some fighting? We're going to see some boxing. Let's go. It's not that cold, though. Look, 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 look. That's crazy. All right, here we go. Tickets, not knowing that we get access to the VIP. We get access. Twenty dollars a beer so far, and we get free beer. We didn't know, so we paid for these beers. And the whole time we have free beers over there. Funny. Guys, you getting the tomahawk? Yes, sir. The tomahawk. Can I get some tomahawk beer?
See you all. See you all, madame. Gracias. Bro, there's a, a freaking cigar lounge right here. Diamond Camp. How sick. All you can drink, all you can eat. All right, now we got this side. Now we got this side of the detail, guys. I was waiting. I was waiting, bro. Four guard. Now I'm at my three guard. And I can skip going all the way open because we've already done that. That's not going to really move the needle much. Close it up some. A little bigger in person, man. Everybody says that, bro. Everybody says it. I'm 227, bro. Six feet tall. It's like people don't believe it. Guess because of YouTube, you know? Yeah. YouTube makes you look smaller, but...